Hello from Epcot. Today, I have a huge, huge announcement to make. I am so excited about this. I feel extremely blessed to have this opportunity that has come up. I can't wait to let you guys in on this secret that I've known about for a little bit now. To make this announcement, we have to go to one of my favorite rides, and that will make sense in a moment. If you know me, you know how much I love Epcot and how much I love one particular attraction here. And it had to be incorporated into this announcement. So let's go there now. I'm telling you, all of this is gonna make sense in a second. people guessed we were coming here living with the land give the video a thumbs up if you guys guessed it this ride right here has a big part to play in my announcement today if you know me you know that living with the land is one of my favorite attractions in all of Walt Disney and I would definitely say that it is my favorite Disney cruise does anyone know where we're going with this <laughs> but I have a feeling that that's about to change and that is because as much as I love this Disney cruise love it with all my heart this month I am going on my first ever actual Disney cruise But just imagine this water will be the Atlantic Ocean instead of <laughs> the living with the land water. And this will be Castaway Key. Some of our best ideas. Yes, it is official. I am going on my very first ever Disney cruise. Not a living with the land boat ride, an actual Disney cruise. I am beyond excited for this. I have never been on a Disney cruise. I have watched so many Disney Cruise Line vlogs for years, literally years, and always dreamed of the day that I would get to go on a Disney cruise. And it really is a surreal moment because I, like, my family and I, we've always like said like, oh, we'll do that like one day when we live there in Florida and could be just like close to the port. And it's like, we always wanted to use our vacation time to come here to Walt Disney World and kind of had it, I think in our minds. So it's like, okay, we'll start branching out and doing other Disney things when that day comes. And so it's kind of crazy that it's another full circle moment. And that was still always kind of the plan was that, you know, me and my parents, I think we're gonna start kind of Disney cruising and maybe trying some different things once they move down. But actually, I've had a very exciting opportunity and I am being sent on this cruise by my sponsor, 407 and Beyond Vacation Company. I am so beyond excited. I have never cruise with Disney before. So I've done other cruises. I've done a Royal Caribbean and a celebrity cruise in the past. And you know, I love cruising. Those were so fun, but I've never done Disney. And I'm a Disney nut, as you all know. And that's why so many people have told me, they're like, Meg, when you cruise Disney, you don't go back. Like you are gonna become addicted to the way Disney's level of service and just everything is on the ship. I can't wait, just there's so many things like that I've seen in other videos that I've always dreamt about, like Castaway Key, for example, their private island. Getting to do just the activities that are on board, they look so fun. They do a version of the Animation Academy on board. There's like Disney trivia. There's like a who wants to be a millionaire style, who wants to be a Mouseketeer type thing. Then they have like all the adult lounges and everything that has specialty activities and things that happen in the like adult only hours there. And it's just like, there's something like literally that covers all the bases of anything that you'd want entertainment wise. Um, the Broadway style shows, oh my gosh. I love theater, I love live theater. That is something like I picture that we are gonna be seeing every single show multiple times if that's even possible. <laughs> I love live theater, so that is something else that I am so excited for. The reason that I am going on this cruise is thanks to 407 and Beyond Vacation Company. Huge shout out to them. They are sending me on their behalf 
I have also gotten the opportunity through this cruise. I got to bring guests with me and my parents are coming with me. Mom and dad are gonna be flying down a few days before and we are all going to be traveling to Miami together. I don't even think I mentioned, yes, the cruise is going out of Miami. So we're also gonna have a Miami, Florida road trip, a place in Florida that I have never been to before. So we're gonna go to Miami and we're gonna be getting on the Disney Dream. That is the ship that is gonna be my very first ever Disney cruise. And I've heard from so many people. So the dream and the fantasy both premiered at the same time or like around the same time. They're kind of like sister ships, similar to how like the magic and the wonder are like the same kind of level. They're like a little bit smaller ships. The dream and the fantasy came out around the same era. So many people though always say they love the dream a little bit more. Like I, I've just heard that from so many people that of all four of the Disney cruise ships, this is probably gonna change now that we have The Wish is now also sailing, uh, which is gonna be the newest in the Disney fleet. But so many people say that the dream is their favorite. So I can't wait to be on board the dream. And yes, mom and dad are coming. So actually I have a little clip from them. I asked them to film what they are most excited about for the cruise. So here's a mom and dad takeover. Hi everyone. So we're so excited uh, because we're going to be going on a cruise with Megan. With Megan, the Disney dream. Yes. And it is a dream. Um, we're so grateful that she mm -hmm. invited us to be her plus two. And um, we haven't been on a cruise in probably, well, um, a long time. About four years before Megan was born. So, exactly. Um, <laughs> we've only been on two cruises. The, the original Big Red Boat, leave a comment if you're old enough to know what the Big Red Boat was. But we were on the Big Red Boat, um, which is a premier cruise line, and I swear it was the Love Boat. It looked exactly it looked like the like, Love Boat. That's what we heard. It was Princess Cruise Line, Princess wasn't? Cruise Line. And, and um, then we were on Celebrity. Celebrity was very nice, and we took Celebrity out of Philadelphia to Bermuda. To Bermuda. And that was really nice also. Um, so my big thing about this would be what's going to be the disney difference that's what i want to see because i have i only have two cruise lines which are probably both defunct now um <laughs> but they were old <laughs> they were old they were very nice don't get me wrong i want to see what the disney difference is with this cruise line yeah and i'm looking forward to you know the obvious spending uh, family time mm -hmm. together um and being with megan and um just seeing the pictures that I've seen and videos that I've seen of people on, on these yeah. cruise lines today are so elaborate. So yeah. I'm looking forward to that. Looking um, forward to food. Food, of course. And then uh, the other thing probably would be uh, Castaway K, mm -hmm. the Disney private island. So we hope that we have a good day and we can get there. And um, one more thing, one more thing now. Um, we're going to try to add one little thing when we come home because we're driving down to Miami to get the get the boat. On the way home, I would really, really like to stop at South Beach, Miami. Okay, South Beach, Florida. Because we've never been... We've never been there, and one of our all-time favorite movies is The Birdcage. Yeah. <laughs> and the Art Deco, the whole vibe of South Beach, we really want to see that. That's one of our favorite movies. Right. If you've never seen it, watch it. It's a very funny movie. Robin, Robin Williams and Nathan Lane, very good very good movie so and then the other thing i, I want to try and be adventurous is to do that aqua roller coaster yeah, so i'm going to try that but um so there, we're so excited and uh yeah so we can't Thank wait you, for everybody to come along thanks megan we love you we can't wait to be back bye bye once again, this cruise is all thanks to 407 and Beyond Vacation Company. This opportunity came about through them. They are sending me so that I can go get content. I have loved getting to partner with them through our partnership so far. And I'm so excited for this, like, you know, next um, just kind of milestone that we get to have together because this is my first ever Disney cruise and they know that they're excited for me to get to go and get content to be able to share with their clients to share with all of you guys and then hopefully you know you'll use of course you need to use their services when you're ready to book your Disney cruise because they are gonna take good care of you you know I say that all the time in the videos but truly working with a expert travel planner that specializes and has training with the Disney product is going to make all the difference because guys like already I've been like relying on the team over at 407 with everything because there's just so many little intricacies with a cruise like 
knowing what's the best for my style of how me and my parents like to do a vacation. Do we want first dining or second dining? How do we handle the whole online check-in? Right now there's still the whole thing with like testing that you have to do before you get on the ship. Um, like all of that stuff and they are able to give you the up-to-date information and you have basically a travel concierge and working with a travel planner costs you nothing more than just booking with Disney Direct so it's kind of like a no-brainer it's like have somebody in your corner that can like handle all the finer details for you travel agents make their money off of commission so their services are literally free to you it would cost you nothing more that's the thing that not many people realize like you it costs you nothing more to book through a travel planner and let them give you all their expert knowledge and services than it would be if you just go and you book directly with Disney. It would seriously cost you the same amount of money. And if you're going just directly through Disney, you have those two, three hour wait times if you have to call for any reason and talk to somebody. Whereas you could let your travel planner do that for you and handle all those things. All you do is shoot them a text and say, hey, help me with this, and they will get right on it. They handle that two hour wait time for you. So big reason why I love 407 and beyond. They've been helping me so much with my first Disney cruise. So yeah, that is the big news. I am going on a four night sailing Disney Bahamas itinerary, going to Nassau, going to Castaway Key for my very first time ever aboard the Disney Dream. I can't wait. This is going to be absolutely amazing. I'm so excited. My parents are so excited. It's going to be amazing too. Mom and dad, they've had a lot of exciting things happen with like their retirement plans and um, meeting with realtors to like sell our house back in Pennsylvania like so many things have been happening recently and we just have a lot to be grateful for a lot to celebrate I'm feeling very blessed like there's a lot going on right now you know life's been crazy it's been moving so fast and everything but you know I'm right now having like one of those moments like sitting here collecting my thoughts at the beach club there's a lot to be grateful for a lot to be grateful for and that's what I'm just I'm so ready, I'm so excited. We are going on a Disney cruise, it is official. I'm planning to make a lot more cruise content coming up in the coming weeks, some packing videos, um, cause oh yeah, the cruise is happening this month. It's happening so soon. I have a lot of things that I want to do before we actually go. Additionally, I'm gonna be chatting a lot about the cruise this coming Friday. So if you're watching this video when it comes out this Friday at 7 p.m. I'm going to be going live doing a live stream from the park so please join me then I want to like get that word out there make sure you're subscribed here on the channel with notifications on so that you get the little notification whenever I will like post a video and then also when I go live it will let you know because yeah come hang out with me in the parks and we're gonna be chatting everything about the cruise okay guys I'm gonna go ahead and sign off here from the Beach Club do you like my backdrop I specifically made sure that I came to like a nautical place on Disney property to make this announcement. And of course I had to ride living with the land. But thank you guys so much for watching this video and truly all the support. It's because of you guys that I am able to have opportunities like this, you know, happening. And I just, I'm so grateful. I feel very, very blessed. So thank you guys. And yeah, please like the video, leave me some comments. All those things go far away in helping to give me support here on the channel. So with that, make today magical and I will see you very soon in my next video and on a Disney cruise very soon. <laughs> Bye guys.